around other women that like were messaging my long-term partner. Yeah, man. I just think that like I'm just very like like seriously traumatized from my past relationships and like it's just this is like how it all kind of started. I'm really, really sorry. I thought we were doing really well. Like, I feel like we were in a good place. We were talking about what our future looked like together. Like, you've literally just had sex with me after so long and then you're messaging that other girl. What the actual, like, I feel hurt and betrayed. I feel like I've been lied to. Like, Stupid. Stop. You don't feel stupid. No, you do feel stupid. Oh, okay. But I do feel stupid. It's just humiliating. I I feel horrible. Obviously, never want to yeah, make you feel that, that way. But it's not good enough for me. All right. We're going to go to the decision. Stay or leave, Jono. Let's go with you first. All right, stay. Lauren, what do you got? Um, I won't stay. But that was obviously before I knew about this situation. John, you need to understand. This is not acceptable. And it's not something that should be given the benefit of the doubt. You're omitting a very important fact here, which is I'm texting another woman who I met in this experiment and you don't know about it. And I'm not telling you. It creates an insecurity in the relationship. It erodes the foundation. She may be reaching out to you, Ellie, but you don't need to be reaching back to her. And here's the other thing. You may say to Lauren and to the group, there's nothing going on here. You don't know that for Ellie. You know, one of our roles is just to make sure we point out when things are going wrong and then we watch closely to see whether you're going to put it right. Jono, you have some heavy lifting to do this week. So really... Think about this next week and, and use it wisely because it's a very big decision you've got to make before final vows. Good luck, you guys. Yeah. Well, well done, everybody. That brings us to the end of the very final commitment ceremony for this experiment. And we are so grateful for how raw and honest you've all been. I'm pissed off. I'm really pissed off. But we finally built up to a good place and it's all just been kind of shut on, really. In terms of this upcoming last part of the experiment, you need to make a huge decision about the final vows. Do you want to take this relationship into the real world? Like, was he messaging her while I was in surgery? Like, in hospital? Like, was he messaging her then? We look forward to seeing how this next week ahead goes for you all. Thanks, a wonderful night, and well done. I definitely want to know more about the situation. I really need to, like, next to the bottom of it before I decided to watch Joe because I just don't feel like I trust John right now.